Hi gamers, this video is extremely specific with the fatal error or the developer error 6036. If you are facing other errors which will be discussed in the video exactly from this minute on the screen. But if you are facing developer error 6036 then let me show you how to solve it or at least how I solved it. Sadly I don't have any video or screenshot of this error because it's not happening right now. I've tried everything, every settings uh, while I had the problem but it's not happening right now for me so instead I have a photograph that I took from my mobile so let's just get into it this is my pc configuration as you can see cpu i5 7500 ram 8 gb which is the main factor here and gpu is r6 2020 so this problem mainly happens if you have low ram so what you have to do you have to first turn on the game then go to options go to graphics scroll down until you see cache spot shadows and cache sun shadows disable them if you have them enabled which will be because by default it's it's always going to be enabled even if you have 8 gb ram after you have done that go to to the lobby search for a match get into a match and see if you face this problem for me this worked after that it never happened again even though i enabled them even though i enabled both of the options try that but if your game still crashes and if you have lower ram so try to turn on taskbar and see if there's any application or software is running that is eating your ram close them restart the game hopefully it will work for you this is how i fixed my problem or at least it worked for me i hope it works for you if you're facing any other problem try these i hope it will work for you first go to your gpu driver settings and see if you have the latest driver installed or not if not then install it go to the windows settings update and security and head for windows update and see if you have the latest windows version if not then do it From Battle.net, go to the options, then game settings, look for additional command, click the box, then type the command and hit done. Lastly, again from the Battle.net, go to the options, then scan and repair, click that, wait for some time. When it's done, then hit the play button and see if it worked for you. I hope it will. So yeah, that's the video. I hope you liked it. Shout out to this guy for the fixes. And if you still have any question or confusion, then leave them in the comment box. And if you have found a new fix for any kind of problem or error, then also share it with us. Thank you. Bye.